for social media platforms, but right now we're checking in with Gary News Now digital reporter Ariana Moyer. She's been tracking some information when it comes to Instagram, some new tools to protect against intimate image abuse or what's called sextortion. Yes, yeah, so this is something that they just deployed today. They put out a blog post kind of talking about this. So they're deploying these new tools to protect young people and to combat sexual extortion. And so if you don't know what that is, that is when somebody persuades a person to send intimate images and then blackmails them, saying that they'll put those publicly out there unless you pay a certain amount of money or you do something in and return this is for Instagram them. Instagram with the, these yes, new protections? Yes, yes. Instagram, I know uh, Meta owns them, but this is just for Instagram specific not Facebook threads or WhatsApp, just Instagram specifically for right now. So what this new feature kind of includes is if anybody sends you a sexually inappropriate image, it'll be blurred before you open it so you won't just open your DMs and see something that you might not want to see. Then if you do decide to open it, you will get a warning message telling you that this is a sensitive content and are you sure that you really want to view it? And then if you are sending those to someone, you will also get a warning message being saying to be careful sending out sensitive content. Um, and they also are letting people that if you do send them, you can unsend them, but it might not be before someone sees it, if that makes sense. Or gets a screenshot of it, right. takes a picture. exactly. But they're putting a lot of more warnings out there and kind of trying to block that. So this feature is going to be automatically enabled for any accounts uh, with users under the age of 18, and they will let people who are 18 above know that there is this new feature and kind of encourage them to turn it on. Obviously, we've seen a lot of social media platforms get under fire for not doing as much to protect young people online. So besides these features, Instagram is working on technology to identify accounts that might be engaging in these sexual extortion scams to kind of stop them before they get too far. Be smart online. The internet can be a dangerous, <laughs> dangerous place. Yeah, and when sometimes you're that old it well. can last forever. Yep. Exactly, yeah. once, exactly. Once it's out there, good luck. More on that on our website, erienewsnow.com. The QR code in the bottom corner of your screen is the fastest way to get there. We, however, head to the Weather Center. John Stalen tracking.